hello guys welcome to my youtube channel scholar tech studio in this video i will teach you how you can import a cad file that you have created in an other software okay so what you have to do first you have to create the stl file of that model okay now you have stl file now we need to import this into edm software okay so here you can see that there is an option that called geometry but before this first we have to uh, create the materials equipment material let's suppose I have created two equipment materials okay and now you can specify the properties according to your requirements okay so now we will select this one and right click on it and here you can see there is an option that called import geometry so you just need to click on it okay now you have to specify the uh, path where you have the STL file okay so let's suppose conveyor so here you can see that there are the STL file conveyor hopper and just said okay and this window will pop up here you can see that the CAD units so here you can specify the units like if you have created your CAD geometry in millimeter then you will select from here millimeter and if you have select uh, if you have created your geometry in meters then you can specify this so it's very important step you must have to specify the exact units that you consider when you was creating your geometry and here we can also uh, select the option is much like if you have uh, five parts of uh, your geometry and you want to consider as a single part in a, a edm environment then you can select this one but if you want to deal with separate parts like some moving parts or uh, some other parts if you want to check forces on different parts then we will not consider this but we can consider this one okay and uh, and then we just need to click okay and we have to wait now here we can see that our model is imported okay so so here you can see that the parts so this uh, body consisted on four parts okay so each part this is the part this one this this hopper type and one this these are the five parts of this uh, geometry okay so now let's suppose you want to assign material one to above two parts so first we select this one and from here we can assign material one and for this is already selected material one but if you want to select specific material the material that you have created here can be shown here okay let's suppose if I select this one by default it select material one and here we can change the material like this part is now is according to our required material so you can create different material you can import to a geometry and you can assign different uh, uh, we can say material to the specific parts and uh, even you can like uh, rename the geometry you can give specific name okay like all the parts have the same name so you can give specific name like this is hopper this is conveyor and this is box so you can uh, rename them from here i hope you like my video please subscribe my youtube channel so that you can get the notification of my upcoming video thank you